The new anti-aging pill. No, I'm not talking about goji berries or or anything else out there at the moment. Don't know what other berries are out there. Or L'Oreal moisturizer, which gets rid of the bags under your eyes from sleeping babies. In my case, touch wood. I know there's still plenty of time for sleepless nights, as I've been reminded of, and no two babies are the same. So, but brings me on to anti-aging pill, as they say. So. It comes from, I sent an article about the, in, from the Daily Mail, which said about an anti-aging pill that could help halt dementia, which is awesome. It's really, really good. But it got me thinking about what you can do now. What are you doing now about that to help the quality of your, your life? So, like a few of my clients said, to be able to go to Kids About and get involved, get straight in. To be able to go around the golfing course with their kids. To be able to... Get through your day without needing eight coffees and that extra flat white and the bit of cake. Without feeling so tired and stressed at the end of the day that you need to finish off the custard creams. And that kind of comes down to your muscle mass, it seems, from the research. And there's two things you can do to help preserve muscle and make everyday tasks easier. You can eat protein. So protein in itself, regardless of exercise, can help preserve and build your muscle even if you're doing not too much you know just look at the norwegians their guidelines they the government guidelines are actually to eat more protein than us and they do pretty well they don't just have pretty mountains they also seem to age very well on top of this you can load your muscles now i don't mean load them with expensive gym equipment because you don't really need that I mean, body weight, walking, or maybe stair climbing, adding a bit of resistance exercise on there. Anything that you enjoy is the most important thing. If it puts a smile on your face, that's a good thing. It's never too late, is what I want to say. They've even shown positive effects in 97-year-olds starting resistance exercise. And it just reminds me of when I did a physique show. We were at the British finals. You know, my dad's in the audience, friends are in the audience and then the over 50s and 60s come on and you think ah, is my is my excuse for not doing it real when you see the physiques and what they've done so it just gets you thinking if you want to learn more link in the comments any questions you got let me know have a great day cheers